The brothers of Tall Kappa Epsilon are finally back on Fraternity Row. After the indefinite suspension of the Delta Chi fraternity during the spring semester, it was announced that Teak would take up residence in the now vacant fraternity house. This is something that we've always wanted, but it, it is a big step. And finally, when this opportunity came about, we jumped on it as soon as we can. And it was a, it was a real blessing from the university. And they were very, very kind to grant us this opportunity. And all of the brothers have been enthusiastic. And we are very, very excited to join the row. Teak was chartered in 1967 here at Troy and is the second oldest fraternity on campus. Despite not having an official house, the brothers continue to grow and have a presence on campus. But now with their own house on Fraternity Row, Peterson says that they are ready to take advantage of their upcoming opportunities. It's a big step forward for Teak. Uh, we have had great success and we've been working very, very hard, but this house will be an asset to our fraternity and will help give us more of an upfront uh, presence here on campus. And that's what we're looking for. And we're going to use it to the best of our ability to make sure that we make our presence known here on campus. While the brothers of Tall Kappa Epsilon may not have had an on-campus building in years, the brothers say that the fraternity is more than just a house. Teak before this even came into picture was just working very, very hard. We're trying to build the culture of success because as much as I love this house, this house is not the fraternity. We are the fraternity. And we've worked very, very hard to get to this point to be able to have this. And now that we have it, we're just going pedal to the metal, moving everything in and getting ready for rush week.